All right. Yeah. We're rolling. All right. All right. Okay. Spark and Plug Talks Season 3. We're here with the mystically talented Rocky Kanega. <laughs> Great to be here. Thanks so much for coming out, man. Oh, thanks, thank for you. thanks for taking me. that drive out from that long and lonesome, uh, not 66 drive from yeah. Bethany. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Turnpike. Yeah, Turnpike. Just remember, not all exits yeah. are uh, cashless. Dollar yeah. seventy five. <laughs> if you if you ever were you gonna take like sixty six like the whole city route out here? Yeah, I was gonna go sixty six. Yeah. Wow, man, I was gonna take you like. I mean, it said like an hour. It said like an there. hour. Three business That's not bad. days. <laughs> and uh, the other way, the turnpikes uh, like forty five, fifty minutes. So it's not that. that oh, there's no shit, way that you're taking in consideration all those stoplights. And, and I mean, but yeah, all those people that turn really. <laughs> but slow there's all on, that construction on, on uh, uh, by Arcadia too. Oh, is there? I haven't been out. Towards it's that way it's kind of shit to be honest. Yeah. Like it it's it sucks. It's not ideal. No, not ideal. Well, yeah. we're glad you made it out here. Yeah. Regardless, <laughs> I, I'm here. Yeah. yeah, just got done playing four awesome tunes for us. Mm-hmm. Um, I usually like to dive into. Uh, kind of your background in music like uh what'd you start listening to what was pops playing on the radio when you were, Ooh, you were younger country like well like classic, classic country. rock well cla- yeah classic country and like classic rock like led zeppelin uh that's not country but yeah. david allen co no, no cover of uh Hank going Williams. to california yeah i love that song i'm working on it i'm working <laughs> oh, on nice. it i can do uh, i can do uh what it, is it i've heard it pronounced two different ways Deer maker or dire maker? Dire. Maker. It's a dire. I think it's dire. Dire maker. Yeah. I think it's, I, I can do that. I, one. I've heard dire. I can do that one. There's some kind of story behind it, and I forgot what it was. You like yeah. Bachman Turner Overdrive? Like some I've, BTO? I haven't heard it. You know, uh, like uh, taking care of business. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's yeah, the, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, that's like their yeah, Walmart right on. Yeah, yeah. generic song, but they got some good yeah. ones. Dude, man. they got some bops in the, in yeah. the discography, but. Right on, man. David then, Allen Coe. Yeah, and then, I mean, my mom had a bunch of uh, 45s, which were like Buddy Holly and like mm. all that old stuff. And Did you dig that, that stuff? Oh, yeah. 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 I like it, like it a lot. Yeah, right on. Yeah. Cool. Yeah, they always say, day the music died, man. Yeah. Rip. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, and that and a bunch of music. And then I got into rap. Oh, sick. Okay. When yeah. was this? Like, uh. Sometime in the nineties or something like that. Vanilla Ice. Oh hell yeah, dude! Who was it last <laughs> time? Oh, yeah, we were talking. Somebody was here last time. We got really in depth on Vanilla Ice. Yeah. You like a tribe called Quest? Yeah. He's kind yeah. of inducted in the rock and roll. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Which uh, is so like I don't even know if that even has any kind of weight anymore. Yeah, I don't know. I don't believe it. Uh, is. you know, who? Ozzy got inducted to like I, same. Yeah. Is it a class? Is, did they call it the yeah, like they, class? Oh class yeah, they're point. elitist yeah. and they say that kind of shit. It took this song for Foreigner to get yeah. in. It's yeah, a fucking travesty yeah. joke. But yeah, joke. I uh, got into Vanilla Ice, MC Hammer, nice. and all that. Naughty by Nature. Learn the dance and everything. Oh yeah, I yeah. Yeah. I, I like <laughs> parachute pants. I, I, I got so serious. <laughs> I think no, like Vanilla Ice. Like I really was into him. Like I, I wanted to. Shave like the eyebrow thing. Like, Dude, nice. I wanted, I wanted his hair you really still bad. Still do that. Yeah. And then, uh, yeah, crisscross. I got in. Oh, yeah, Dude. Yeah. And then, uh, you then I got into gangster rap. Nice. Yeah. And my brother had to buy me those lot cassette, of, cassette oh, tapes. <laughs> a lot of NWA. <laughs> and yeah, I like Doctor Dre. Six Mafia. Yeah. Eh, eh nah. not so much. Not so Three Six Mafia. Uh, <laughs> it was like West Coast. Like, uh, like what Three Three Six Mafia is what? Like, like I think they're out, is it aren't they? South, south like Texas Isn't or there, like? Are they from like Memphis or something? Could shit? be. Yeah. Yeah. They they got the dirty South sound. Maybe yeah. they're from Atlanta or Memphis. But yeah, I was yeah, like into the like West Coast. Okay. Like Doctor Dre, Snoop Dogg. Dog, you know, yeah, okay. Yeah. Chronic, Chronic, great album. Yeah, those are those are easy to really like kick back and listen to. So yeah. So was your world? uh your worldview completely exploded whenever the Gorge released their cover of Gin and Juice. It's like the best of both. <laughs> well, like Not when I sure. first started playing guitar, they're gonna public enemy and uh, Anthrax. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> that too, that too. Yeah, rock your world. Man. When I first started playing guitar, uh, I learned a bunch of Dave Matthews songs. Naturally, like and, everyone uh, does. And uh, I was playing too much, and I was playing open mic nights, and I would start, and I was like, you can rap anything over this 
<laughs> so like I would it get to the, the end. Formula. <laughs> I would get to the end of this is a long time ago too. And this is mm, two thousand, and I would basically I started rapping. Of time. I started yeah. I started rapping uh, Ice Ice Baby at the end. I can't believe you're willing to admit this publicly. And then yeah, well people loved it. <laughs> no, people I'm just people that. ate it up. And then like I just kept adding like whatever I would think of <laughs> like at the moment, and I would just and it kept building and building, and then finally. I had so much rap that it become became this medley, and it was just like gangster rap. Whatever I would think of, I would just let wow. it go, and everybody loved it back and then. And you were Eminem's ghostwriter. Yeah, no. And that's when shit and, uh, got out of hand. And but I had to quit it now, all now it's really funny because my older friends, like my age, they still want me to do it. And if you don't really rap often, like I don't do it, I'd like. <laughs> I barely do it. It sounds a little hokey. Well, you know, well, just you're not used to it, and like you don't. It's kind of hard to get that flow like back. I mean, I still have it, right? But and then plus remembering all the words. But you have to look at your crowd because <laughs> if they're twenty oh, and they're yeah, they just and I I'm up there making 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 it back, daddy. <laughs> They just think I'm some old white guy up there just <laughs> l- rapping. Bastards, man. Yeah. They don't know how to they, I, they have no clue what I'm <laughs> rapping. Man, kids, man. But Talk if they're me. my age, then it, like, they, they get it. Yeah, yeah. I got you. Because so, okay. I don't know any new rap. That's pretty interesting, man. No, it's you, not a rap. You have to like, slow your shit down and mumble. Yeah. 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 And and you, just, I was going to say, you need some wicked guitar effects yeah. where it's just yeah. like, some crazy auto tune. Repeat too. the same line like over and yeah, over. That, Those that guys will chair. be like, Then Fair. you'd be cool. Yeah. yeah. Then you'd be yeah. cool. Yeah. I was in uh, when... Uh, what's that one? Uh, that... Uh, oh, what's her name? Cardi B? or It's uh, really like... Uh, it's Nicki Minaj or something. No, it's ooh, that's some what? Uh, yeah, 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 Cardi, Cardi B. B. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Wop. yeah. yeah. What has pussy? Yeah, I was like, yeah. <laughs> I was uh, God at damn. a bar and Jesus. I was loading out and that was my first time to hear it and I was like, man, that is a dirty song for a girl to be singing. Like, Hell yeah, it is, like, dude. Like, it's like I was like, like I, I just wasn't used to. Fe- I guess things of times have changed. She getting it. I mean. Yeah. The guys used to talk it, not it, it. Exactly. It ain't no crisscross. Yeah. Like, yeah. now the girl's talking, and you're like, I mean, something about, yeah, I was just, all right, you're supposed it's, to be better than us. <laughs> it's a naughty song. <laughs> yeah. Dude, uh, no covers? Um, yeah. <laughs> you don't see the 20-year-old crowd, and you're like, WAP's going to go over really good right no, now. No, <laughs> like, I, I've thought about it. That would be fucking hilarious if you finger-picked that song, too, <laughs> yeah. and you're like, I've like, thought about really? it. And get a bucket and some mop. <laughs> a lo- and a lot of people uh, there for a while when I was doing that rap like a long time ago. Mm-hmm. They were like, "Oh, that's the best song you do." Oh, really? And I'm like, "Shit, really? <laughs> like, really? <laughs> like, I'm all I'm, I'm doing." I'm not is- sure if that's an insult yeah, to my it's song like, It's really, like, it's really bad. Like, you're I on took the track it like to that. the one hit wonder rock <laughs> but, band. But I wasn't wonders are covered. Yeah, but I wasn't really writing many songs back then. Like, I mean, just when did you start? A handful. When did you start writing? When I first got a guitar, oh, okay, uh, but not very many. Like, and when I, what age I, did you start playing? When was that around? Oh, twenty-one. Okay, okay, right on. Okay, I should be a lot better than I am. Well, no, I, it's just some people. They're like, it. It just varies. You know, I some started, people they're like twelve. You no, know, no, it's, it's just. I started out on drums. Sick. And uh, still play. Hmm. It's kind of hard. If, to keep I, a if, drum I, set if I see around. a drum set, I'm like, yeah, like or yeah. whatever. But uh, I'm better at hand drums. Was that Led now. Zeppelin in you? Yeah, I'm better at hand drums now than I am an actual drum set. But uh, no, I uh, went to. I, I loved Carter from Dave Matthews Band. Yeah, Carter Bo. Oh, <laughs> what a monster, dude! Monster. And uh, I went Did to. You, wa- you had to have watched that VHS tape. Yeah. Where he's teaching. I had it. I've never seen anybody yeah. play so good in a wetsuit, man. <laughs> yeah. He's amazing. Uh. I had it, like, and then I went to a Texas concert of them live, and, like, that was my first concert to see them live, and I was like, screw drums, I want to, I want to yeah. be that dude. Dude, like, I, I so. love, uh, I love Dave Matthews' band, but, and I haven't seen them live, I haven't had a chance to see them live, but I don't like jam bands live, it's not really my thing, like, I've seen Fish live, 
I've they're, seen. They're they're not like fish. Oh, thank God. They're okay. not like. I mean, they they have their. That makes me more excited to see them. Eventually. They have their jams, and maybe. But, but they also get at the point. Yeah, you know, they like, have their songs where it's, it's yeah. not every song is going to be a jam. Oh, thank God, dude! So like, yeah. just, some songs are just. I didn't familiarize hey, myself with Fish's minutes, entire discography, yeah. so I was yeah. like, "Is this song ended yet, or yeah. is this the yeah. next song?" Yeah, I can never, I couldn't tell. This is people who are like jam head fish, head, you know what is it? Yeah, <laughs> fish heads, fish heads, fish yeah. heads. People who are fish heads right now are like, "Listen to this fucking idiot!" But like, I'm sorry, dude. I it just is that really I can't their get name it. is fish, yeah, heads. fish heads. Yeah, I don't hey, think and Jimmy I don't Buffett think Buffett is parrot heads. Yeah. R.I.P. It may not be fish head. Is it fish heads? Fish food? I don't know. I don't know, but it's fish I, 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 some of them don't <laughs> like some of them don't like Dave Matthews fans because Dave Matthews they don't consider Dave Matthews a jam band. Oh my god, there's turf wars and yeah. and this shit. <laughs> but, this is hilarious. I want but, I need to look at the subreddit like, pages to turf this. War. <laughs> but if you go to a Dave Matthews concert, you may get there are some songs that he'll play that are like 14 could last 14 20 minutes. That's fine. Were, That's if, okay as long as I know that there this is a song. But not every song, like, okay. not every song. If and, you wore a Dave Matthews band shirt at a Fish concert, that some may not like. No it. one's gonna share their joint with you. Yeah, is it? Is it? It's not like mean. Is it like more like passive aggressive stuff? You know? I don't. I'm. I've. I've never been to a fish concert, so I don't know. People don't know have told crowd. me. Okay. People have told me. Dude, like, I don't, don't go. Know. Allegedly, the, the power to people. I'm who not. Like, I'm not big into. Out there, I'm not big yeah, into jam go. bands. Like, I'm, well, man, like, there's like really good ones. Like, I don't know. Would you consider King Gizzard and Lizard Wizard a, a jam band? Because they were crazy when I saw them. But like, Goose uh, is good, dude. I, I do. I, I, like, I, Goose. I like Goose. Yeah, because like he can sing. Like, I mean, yeah, he I can. like his voice. Have you ever listened to Geese? No. There's an actual. Is it really? Is yes. there more than one? <laughs> no, no, no. It, there's just one called Geese. And, That'd be funny uh, if the dude's name was Goose, yeah. and then when we played with the band, it was called Geese. Geese, Geese. yeah. That's no, fucking, I, uh, that's actually kind of genius. I, that I thought good. that might be the case because, but then I was like, no. Why were they so far on this festival? They're like so far down on the lineup. So I listened to them, and they're two completely different bands. Yeah. But I was like, how bizarre! This is the the spawning of multiple geese. Yeah, there's a lot of jam so, bands named after animals. Yeah, yeah. I guess so. Elk. Is that one? No, I'm just oh. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, interesting. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That could be your new Wombat. one. Wombat. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, nice. if, you, if you get a chance to go, go. I mean, oh, and don't, but don't, don't expect him to play his hits. Man, I just I saw a video. This guy was like, the only went, song I want to hear there, is "Tripping Billies." Yeah, he went there. And he you was may like, get it, you may not. So <sighs> well, he was like, "That's the only one." Come on, man, play really play number forty one. Yeah, is he gonna play number forty one? He's like, everybody's like looking around him and shit. He's like, "Come on, dude, just play number 41 one." They're like, he got cut to the end of the concert. He's like, "All right, guys, update." He didn't play number forty one. Yeah, but he did play "Ants Marching," so yeah. that was cool. Yeah, so yeah, <laughs> yeah. I mean, you'll get something that you recognize. Yeah. But okay. Right on. The, his, every, he changes set list every. Okay, every yeah. show is a different set list. It's like Pearl Jam. So, Pearl Jam is my favorite band. Yeah. It's only the uh, they, it's uh, only the purists. Yeah. Of yeah. Dave Matthews bands. Yeah. Right on. Yeah. So I mean. And you've seen Dave Matthews uh, a lot. bunch of times. Yeah. Okay. So you you experience. <laughs> I'm not it. like some of the some. Of the, you will probably think that my number's high. Thirty one. I've seen them thirty one times. Rookie numbers. Come on, bro. No, really, like, they like, are. Dude, like, I don't know if I've been like thirty one shows. Like. There are some people that have seen him. You, if you totaled him up, I bet you'd be more than what you. Does festivals count? Thought. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh okay, then yeah. Of some course, people yeah. have seen him over two hundred times. That's kind of. I just don't know, man. Wow. I don't know if I. But can. every show's different. But still, two hundred. That's like I, I like the best place I went was at the Gorge. He doesn't even have that many songs. How many you money know, and how many T-shirts does, is but, that? Oh, I did times thirty. I don't get T-shirts. 600. I get the poster. Wow. I get uh, posters. Two hundred dollars times fifteen. So I have a bunch of posters. Yeah, I do, yeah, I also love. I, yeah. I love my posters. So, and they're like a lot if of. They them. got three quarter sleeves. That's what kills me. Yeah, forty five dollars. <laughs> he does oh, love those. Th- a lot of them are sleeves. in the the little containers still. Yes, so. perfect, yeah. beautiful. Yeah. You take them out every yeah. now and then. You're like, oh, what a yeah. show. Yeah, reminisce. <laughs> Sniff it. Yeah. Go, man. The mushrooms. You saw. <laughs> you saw you uh, at the gorge. Gorge in Washington State. You ever seen? Like, I've seen. Oh, I've I know what venue this. you're yeah. talking about. That was, I bet that was incredible. Ah, uh, awesome. Yeah. Have yeah. you seen them at Red Rocks? Have not. No. Uh, I've had. I've never been to a concert at Red Rocks. Okay. I've uh, been there, but I'm not when there was a concert. Yeah. Right so. on. Yeah, I've had people tell me like, 
one one in a million experience. Yeah. Now it's a like a lot of country. Yeah, it's like almost there. like a weird pilgrimage for those like up and coming country. Which is cool. Guys. Like I'd like to I mean Tyler Childers would be really cool to see. Oh that. hell yeah, dude. And, he's got an awesome stage presence. I didn't think he was mm. gonna have it, but he's got like a really It reminds me of like an old like gospels like it's almost like a church yes. like vibe like yeah, he's yeah. Like, mm, yeah he's like because of how commanding yeah he he's he's like his fists are grasping a lot and he's like <laughs> it's like scott you know? stapp yeah but like wow. w- way less awesome what a what a great <laughs> worst concert worst concert i've ever been to no way really yeah, scott creed stapp. creed oh it was the whole creed what yeah. was that long time ago uh what was that 99 was oh that Hammer. was their heyday 99 that was like that was like the big was he just fucking oh, it was yeah. just no nah, no nah, I, like I, I didn't mind Creed, like, and I it just it made me really sleepy. Like it was, <laughs> I don't know why. Oh, like it was just, yeah. Like I don't know. It, was, it just wasn't entertaining. Dude, I've been like, there when you start thinking more about other shit than that. I, I just when you're like, home. yeah, my feet kind of hurt. I it's wish like I the the movie Pleasantville when it came out. Did you go <laughs> oh, see that? Man, that yeah. was a weird fucking. That was movie. horrible. Like, the, the one with Tony <laughs> McGuire and and I don't know who was in it. It was black and white and went color. Tony McGuire and Reese. Weatherspoon. God. That movie made me feel weird. That I movie. Like that. It had that Willie was, Macy and shit in Creed there. Pleasantville yeah. right there. Yeah, okay. <laughs> a similar Same, feeling. Yeah. That's Odd, like, man. That's a that's an interesting parallel to run. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Have you seen Pleasantville? Uh-uh. It's not very pleasant. Yeah. <laughs> You're not uh, missing anything. That I, has the... I get the... I get what they're trying... I get the message. That has the across. across the universe cover in it, right? Does it... Huh? Does, does that have the Across the Universe cover by Fiona Apple or something like that? She does that cover uh, of the Beatles song. Something like that, yeah. Is the cover of them like there, there's like a guy like dip, there's like a girl in a red dress or something and she, he's yeah, like dipping Yeah, it's in black and white and shit. Yeah, yeah okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I only know it because of that Fiona Apple yeah. It, cover. It, yeah, I get the message you're trying to get across. It was it just, it got to the point where it's just like, ah, oh, Jesus Christ, man. I get the whole 50s thing, you know? Mm-hmm. Like, we get it. Yeah. The, That's kind of how I felt about La La Land. I we, haven't watched that one yet. We left early. <laughs> we didn't make it through. Doesn't it. that piss you <laughs> off? Doesn't it kind of like you got to leave Wait, a movie? You're just yeah. like, man, fuck this, dude. Yeah, it was. I've done uh, that before. It was, uh, it, bastards. I, was like, I think that's the only movie I've done that. Wow. What a title to own. Pleasantville. Rocky's Fuck least it. enjoyable movie. Yeah, Pleasantville and Creed. <laughs> it's kind of crazy, man. I hope both the mics that we hear this. What's weird is <laughs> they th- both love they're going on tour again, Creed. Yeah. Yeah, they're coming and back. And I thought know. about going. <laughs> I thought about like, giving them. they redeem the Yeah, I thought about giving them a second chance. I was like, man. man. you know what's weird is that, like, uh, the company I work for, we do like, live production, and we did this thing called uh, Honeymoon Rock Fest mm-hmm. like two years ago, and uh, Scott Stapp like, headlined it. And we have, like, we recorded it. That's what we were hired to do is to do iMac, like, record all of it. And so we have these recordings, and we would always watch it. Like, every now and then we'll pull up these recordings. There's actually some cool bands. Like, Candlebox was there. It was yeah, cool yeah. to watch those, but we would always I, pull the Scott I was into Stapp them. one. I yeah. fuck with Candlebox. And uh, that shit was really, really rough. And Michael, this old sound guy that works there, uh, he was like, fuck, man, I did them back in 98. And shit. Scott was so good. I don't know what the hell happened to him, but this is bad. And I was like, this is pretty rough, man. And then it's like, Creed, Arena Tour. And I was like, whoa, holy shit. Yeah. Did this guy get better? Or yeah. is he just phoning it in? I don't know. And I kind of want to go to one to see if this, if he was, if he's like, you know, yeah. reeled if, it if back he, in. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because he was all over the place. I don't know, place. man. In like 2007, 2008, you know, there's those videos of him like singing and stuff in there. Well, he had he got he he had a bad drinking problem. I think yeah, or he, drugs. He or went something. on that Spike show. Yeah. Remember yeah. That, the Spike sh- the the network Spike. He went on the on a show on there, and he was just fucking trash. It was horrible. Yeah. He was doing like karate and shit. <laughs> yeah. and stuff. And we were like, whoa, yeah. Scott. He well, like, that's what that. he kind of does on stage. Like he does weird <laughs> yeah, stuff. But it's, he was fucking hammered. That was like. But yeah, yeah, I thought about going, like, giving a second chance. But then I saw that Limp Biscuit was touring. You got to go. Come on, dude. You got to go. Oh, I'm going. Go okay, oh, dude. no, no, no. Hell yeah, dude. I love them back in the day. Them and Deftones. Like, that's the... That is sick. It went from gangster rap to that. Is it great at, how like, everybody's getting a soft spot for those bands now? Oh, All the butt man. rock bands are getting... Were you at Woodstock 99? No, but I wish I would have been. <laughs> I don't think you... 
Like how? I don't know, man. After, have you seen the documentary? Oh yeah, yeah. No, I mean not like at the moment. Like back in ninety nine, definitely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah if you looking back, you're like, I might have yeah, died. Nah, yeah. Side, yeah, you would have got. Like, I might have been and crushed, then, set and on then fire. That yeah. many people poop water like, on you, yeah, raped. Like you know, yeah, yeah. I'm not a really I'm like on. fan of big groups or like big, gatherings. Big large. Oh yeah, like festivals. massive. Like I just like don't there. like. I don't like to be bumped so into. Many, like, yeah, I don't like. Yeah, yeah. I like to have my space. So when I. Get a concert ticket. I usually, if I'm going to sit in a seat, I usually try to get right at the end of the aisle. So yeah. I have nobody yeah. next to me. That's nice. Like, but. It's better to be the guy that's sitting and has to stand up as opposed to the guy that's having to make other people stand yeah. up. Yeah. I hate that shit. Yeah. Yeah. It's always weird. You, you know, always my, end up. You want my ass? Like myself, or I always my drink a ton of water, face. you know, as I'm sitting there because yeah. I can't. And so I'm constantly, I'm like, oh, I got to pee again. But yeah. it's like, in any other circumstance, that would be totally fine. Or but if then you get like, like four people have chili to stand dog, up. Yeah. You know, you're trying to chill a dog and some nachos. <laughs> you're like, Excuse me. Sorry. You want my yeah. ass or my dick in your face? No, you Which are doing you some weird sexual almost dance trying to not touch people in a weird way. Yeah. But, yeah, no, it is it is, it is, is that weird kind of. Would you go on a cruise ship, the the cruise? Oh, yeah, uh, like the, the cruise of rock or whatever it was. Rock, the Creed was playing I, on. I, I, Again, I'm being I used to get really Creed. bad motion sickness. So I think. Probably wouldn't be for you then. Yeah. yeah. Like the, the only the, thing that can make motion sickness worse boat? is that Scott Stapp is singing shitty like, <laughs> can you take me <laughs> higher? <And you're> just, <laughs> like, this, this, this girl I know, uh, she loves his voice. She loves it. That One in a minute. Uh, Does she like Eddie Vedder? But yeah, yeah. Oh, well, I don't know. Well, who doesn't? <laughs> I would imagine so because it's pretty much. Have you ever seen the Scott Stapp versus Eddie Vedder celebrity death match mm. on MTV? No. It's like, this, it's like this. It's like the animated. Yeah. Yeah. It's like that. I used to watch them. I the claymation, yeah, yeah. like they're ripping off each yeah. other's heads. That'd be a good one. Yeah. I'm sure it's on YouTube. <laughs> yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, it, yeah, it was yeah. one. It was pretty good. <laughs> uh, but yeah, the boat. Yeah. At Frontier yeah, no City. No bueno. Oh yeah. That like if I ride it too much or whatever, like oh, yeah. it gives it might me, like, die. Yeah. It gives me motion sickness. Well, yeah, those, <laughs> that, like, that, get, like I feel like I'm still going. Those cruiser rock shows. I mean, they they you wouldn't be. It wouldn't be happening during Hinder or uh, or Creed. It would be they're, they're, Hinder's it, probably on there It would there be too. happening either during Hinder or like Alien Ant Farm. Actually, I'd be down for Alien Ant Farm. Yeah. <laughs> I like I like. I went to school like with criminal. Uh, the lead singer or the old lead singer. Yeah, Austin was oh, he a cool okay. guy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, mm-hmm. dope. We played baseball together back in high school. Sick. He threw yeah. a mean fastball. Uh, How was his crow hop? Well, he pitched uh, for a while mm-hmm. and then he s- switched to. Uh, like infield, which was or second base, which was really weird. weird because Sounds he, like he was a jerk. pretty tall. I mean, yeah. usually second basemen aren't very tall. Right, the I short played, little because I fast played guys. second ba- base. Yeah, okay, was, yeah, like, yeah. And he's like six foot or six. Put him over there on first. Know. But yeah. yeah, but I think we already had a first baseman. <laughs> so, but yeah, couldn't make it. As he a was pitcher. younger. He was younger than me. Oh, so, I got you. Okay. So. Yeah, just curious. That's kind of cool, though. I do have a really good story about him, but well, I don't know if I should. Come on, let's, I let's hear I should say it. it. Come on. Because he's sober now. Well, I guess I could say it. but We uh, can take it off the air if we yeah, want. Yeah, if there was a person that had an affiliation with Hinder who might have, may or may not have been their lead singer, this story is possibly <laughs> or not possibly it. about them. It's totally up to you. We don't sign NDAs here. No, nah, I'm not going to say it. Okay, all right. <laughs> never mind. <laughs> Rocky's backing out on us. I'll just say it was a, it was a good time. It was at a strip club. Oh, and somebody's having a good time. Wop people, <laughs> wop. That's all we need to know. The uh, so when do you uh, how how many how many song how, how many albums do you have out? Ooh, well, I, we recorded one long time ago. Uh, Kanega was the name of the group. It was. <laughs> Real original Rocky yeah, well, G. No, no, I, 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 didn't, <laughs> I didn't want it to be that because I was like, nobody Fan will Kanga. be able to pronounce it. Everyone was like, Kanga, nobody could, yeah. Kanga rules. <laughs> everybody would pronounce it wrong. And uh, the drummer wanted it. So, and then uh, we recorded songs at his house and an album. And I just got done, or like, no, it's two years ago. Okay. Just got done with a uh, breathing rhythm studio recording there. And, I was going to just release the whole album, but then I was like, well, might as well just do them as singles. And 
Yeah, you know. That way, just in case somebody people. doesn't listen mm-hmm. to that song. You know how yeah. people just go, yeah. So now they <laughs> have to. Yeah, yeah, that's so right. Well, you got to. And gotta, now, like, I, when, once I get the last single out, like, you I just spoon put feed them on the album. Yeah. And, like, just do it that way. Yeah, so, right yeah. on, man. But, How was the recording process for you? It's good. Like, I mean, it's my first time being in an actual studio. Studio. Yeah. So it was kind of nerve wracking. Why? Well, I, I take that back. Before I went to Breathing Rhythm Studio. Well, I went there first, and then the pandemic hit. Oh yeah, so everybody shut down. And so, especially him, because he had like, uh, what is it? You mean immune, 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 immune uh, yeah, yeah. Immune yeah, 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 yeah. And uh, so we couldn't do anything. Right. And we just at first we thought it was going to be like everybody thought it was just going to end in a couple of weeks. No. Yeah. yeah, it wasn't looked that way. Yeah, so we were out of, so, out here, man. We just yeah. opened this place. Well, we were talking about when we yeah. first met you there. Yeah. It was about that time we had just opened this place up. We were going out, talking to people, and then it was like, you can't see one another. Yeah. We were like, well, bad time to open a studio. So probably a month or a month and a half in, I wrote these two songs that were kind of about the pandemic. And it was a little after that, uh, my friend Luke Tallon, he works at, or I don't know if he still does, but... uh Castle Row. Right. Yeah. And they were still open, but I mean, you could, had to wear your like mask and everything. And right. So I went and recorded there. Oh, okay. Two songs and released those two before the album. Yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah. Everything. And then uh, resumed it after. Yeah. Being in a studio was different and kind of nerve wracking because. Yeah. Just, uh, everybody has their own experience. Yeah. But I mean, it's fun. Experience. Like, I, yeah. I mean, and uh, Breathing Rhythm was really cool because, uh, Steve, I remember the first day we, because I went in there with like thirty songs. Whoa! And uh, trim them down. Just went a in there, bit. just went in there and played them like I did here. Yeah. And uh, for like two hours or however long it takes to play thirty songs, I guess two hours. <laughs> but uh, yeah. then we went and listened, and then he was like, we whittled them down to like try to get them down to fourteen. Whew. And. <laughs> I'm going to like every song. Yeah. You're like, no, so, man. Well, no, no, no. Yeah, we can't cut right. that one. That was yeah, really good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so he was like, <laughs> at, like, they were after like six song or something. He was like, how do you like this one? I was like, I like it. He was like, you're going to like every song because you wrote it. He was like, but do you really like it? That's what you have to pick. Yeah. So we picked 14. You're making me pick between children. Picked 14 and then we started working on one. And uh, this was the first day we started working on one. Is it a fully acoustic um, album? Rec- yeah, album. No, no, no. The, the, oh, it's we full band. It, yeah, oh, okay, yeah. sick. And uh, but we're listening to the acoustic track, right? And, and like the like, and he's listening to it, and we're in the booth, like the little like command or whatever you call it. Right, right, right. Control uh, room. Yeah. And uh, we're listening to it, and then he just gets up and goes out there in the main like room, sets up this big like like marching band kick drum like and puts it up and then mics it up then he starts boom 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 then he goes and grabs a shaker and then starts shaking and just starts building all this stuff and then goes to like a xylophone and like doing these bells and at first i'm like what the hell's he doing this sounds like, like ass I, yeah. I need my i need a and then he, then he comes in there and he's like let's listen to that and then he plays it back and then he just made this whole like percussion like, wow. like it sounded like yeah and That's i was sick, like man so when i first saw that like after seeing that when he would go do those things just let him do it yeah <laughs> no matter how long it would take because right. it would take him some because he'd go over to the piano too and like do stuff or grab a guitar and like I don't well, mean, that's it's really good. He had uh, faith in him to like, yeah, like add I to mean, the song to the best. You know, sometimes that's hard to find, um, especially first time going into a studio and stuff. Yeah. I'm sure, it's kind of like I hope whatever he plays, I like because it might be a little weird yeah. if I'm like, yeah. hey, I don't like it. And it wasn't the actual line. It was just something like for an idea, because right? Because he right, wasn't right. going to play guitar or drum. I mean, he did play drums on it. Yeah, but uh. But we had like a another guy come in and play bass, a uh, David Leach. Oh, right on. Play bass okay. and piano, and then uh, Isaac Stalling came and played yeah. guitar, and then Casey from Bottom of the Barrel came and did some strings. Sick man. And yeah, then, yeah, good in, uh, ensemble. In yeah, there. and then friend Katie came and sang on a song. 
And then my friend Aaron Newman came and sang. And then I think that's everyone that came on it. Came yeah, hell yeah, man. That helped out. Uh, when was it When was it uh, officially uh, put out? It hasn't been put out. Oh, it hasn't. It yeah, hasn't. Yeah, oh, like, that's right. You said you were releasing yeah, singles. Yeah, yeah my bad. I've got okay. two more singles. Okay, sick. Okay. It'll Very probably cool. be out by July. String it out, dude. String it <laughs> out. Come on. Edge all those people, man. That's what you like, want. It's, it's, I mean, it's been done for two years. So. What's the matter? Yeah. It don't. So. I mean, guy, you're playing. <laughs> you're playing every freaking night, so, yeah. you know, you, you got to be. Just trickle it out there. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. you're slowly you, but, you building that audience, man. But it's, I mean, it's fun, I guess. The, uh, well, yeah, man. I mean, it's it's awesome that you, like, completed it and, like. Oh, yeah, yeah, know, that, yeah. That was, and I, I love being in a studio. That's a bad ass I love, like, if, if I could get paid to write songs and just go record them. Is, and, it, is that what like, is, uh. And just, like. There's another, yeah. Invent, or, like, I mean, not invent, I mean, just. just I wish my see. day job was every time yeah, I woke up. because it it's amazing to me. I need. That you can have this little acoustic song, and it can just become this big thing, like yeah. just this little acoustic song. It is kind of insane. Yeah. And it's like, I mean, you add like drums and like strings, and then it you just add becomes all that stuff, like, and it's like take it Whoa. back all down way. Yeah, and, and it was just like this like little later. acoustic song. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, I, I like that. And, but yeah, man, that's fantastic. The, yeah, uh, I mean, I, I still like playing too. Right. Like, well, I mean, obviously, I would, yeah. you play like yeah, like. Okay, there's what out of X amount of days in the month, how many are you playing? I counted because this April and May are my busiest that yeah. so far, and uh, I counted, and I think it was I'm playing fifty shows and forty nine and or I well I started counting. Before April, so it was like forty nine and fifty four days or something. Yeah. Like that. <sighs> Dang, but, dude. Eh. Somebody's <laughs> got to do it. <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, yeah. Like I said, like I, I would just be at home playing. Like I mean, is might it? As well go get is this your yeah. full time yeah. job? Oh, yeah, like, yeah, oh yeah. hell yeah! Well, I, yeah. I mean, that's a you know, and that's admirable in of itself. And sometimes I'll play twice a day. That's. I bet those are kind of killer. Especially getting old, yeah. <laughs> like well, like and like when you have to bring in your own sound. Yeah, and especially like being a fan of Dave Matthews. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah. Those, those are a lot of finger stretches. Man, that's kind of insane. Mm. Oh well, a lot, a lot of weird rhythms. I don't I don't play as much Dave as I used to. <sighs> I do like I play Tripping Billies. That's fantastic. I do play that yes. song. Keep it going. Uh, and it, I really got talked into that. I was playing at the Lumber Shack. And one of my friends was there, and he was like, do you know Tripping Billies? And I was like, oh, I haven't played it in years. Mm-hmm. And I started playing it. Just all and well, I started playing. Yeah. <laughs> well, I started playing it thinking, like, it wasn't going to go well. And, like, like it would end in, like, blade. probably a minute. Yeah. But I started playing, and I was like, man, I'm, I'm this is going pretty good. <laughs> like, And then I got done with it, and I was like, I should start playing that more because that, was, that <laughs> nice. wasn't bad. I played that one. Uh, I played Bartender a lot. Nice. Grace is gone. Uh, it's all good ones, Ben. Where are you going? I play every now and then. Crush, I play a lot. Uh, Ants marching. If I yeah, have, a, if yeah. I have another guitar player, I'll play Ants marching. You I was, and me. I, uh, I the new stuff. I don't I, like. Haven't really, like. Because the reason I know so many like it's all the old <laughs> Pl- stuff. Yeah, played because a whole when lot. I when I. So the new stuff, I kind of, I was moved on from mm. playing Dave Matthews. Like, I learned guitar by watching uh, the uh, listener supported VHS tape. Oh, sick! So I would slow it down and watch his hands. Yeah, and I'd count the frets, and like that's how I learned oh, how okay. to play. Yeah, that was YouTube before YouTube. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So back then, I used to play a lot of his songs the same way. Oh, right on. Very and, cool. Yeah. Well, then you start learning that you didn't. <laughs> there's easier ways to play. Right? Well, right. But <laughs> yeah. Because yeah, his hands. Dave Matthews isn't exactly the best. Be, <laughs> his hands have to be gigantic. Yeah. He's probably like yeah, well, quadruple like jointed like, yeah. or something. The, way, and, uh, the shit he plays is like, God damn, dude. And uh, I was watching an interview with him and he was saying that he 
I forget the guitar player he was fascinated with, but he tried to like emulate like yeah him. But he didn't know that the other guitar player was playing in a different tuning. Oh shit! So like the stretches of yeah. like that's oh how he God. was like that's why he's yeah. having a stretch. One to six, one yeah. to six. But, yeah, horrible. But yeah, so well, dope man. Um, so you got your two singles coming up. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah. which is super sick. Yeah, the I'll, album will be released sometime in the yeah. future, but who cares about? Oh, what the a nightmare is out right now. Okay, very cool. Uh, yeah, and you played that one for us. Uh-huh. And, and then yeah. uh, what's the other one out? The other ones. Out? The other uh, single out. Uh, uh, TikTok's out. TikTok. Okay, yeah. played both of them. Uh, yeah. uh, the other two aren't on the album. They're just like brand new. Oh, songs. okay, sick, awesome. So even better. Yeah, even more rocky to go around. Hell yeah, man. So yeah. I was going to play a really new song, but I don't know the words very well. <laughs> so I, Well, I, no worries. I could I could have done it. And like, cause we'll nobody, have you back for round two sometime. Yeah, and nobody really knows. Hopefully, then. Brent will come and play with me. Yeah. Like, yeah oh, yeah. So like, yeah. Bring but, the string um, section. Yeah. So they're kind of pricey, but. <laughs> <laughs> right yeah. on, brother. Just bring the whole band, man. Yeah. I don't, have a, I don't really have a band. Uh, I just have Brent comes and plays every now and then guitar and then i have an old drummer and yeah sometimes we'll every now like and if then, we yeah. play at like brewskis okay or uh nice. okie tonk he'll come and play but then we just kind of play the game well it's a game to us we're like you remember this one yeah, <laughs> yeah. well let's Give me see some trip and you billies. remember this one <laughs> oh no, 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 yeah, I, I don't think we could do that full band we could do it me and brent but yeah you don't want to put that drummer through the ringer and yeah <laughs> And I tried to learn, relearn a uh, satellite. That's a tough uh, one. The correct way, and I can play it, but I can't. I can sing it that's through a, the first verse that's a and play tough it. Tough one. But I, I haven't done it in a long time. I play Crash every now and then. That one, talk about a cramp. Yeah, yeah. That yeah. thing cramps your hand. That was and the I, first Dave Matthews band. That was first. Yeah, that was the first song I learned. Really? Oh, great. Yeah. And I was like, "Fuck this, man! <laughs> what the fuck?" Yeah. I came back to it like two or three times before I actually learned it. Yeah. It depends on how good I'm feeling to play that one. Yeah. Uh, but I, I try. I was trying to learn uh, the Stone. My thing is, is just learning any new song. If I don't know it, like. It takes a it's, lot for me. Yeah. To you know, sit and it's down. not even really worth it. You know, to what sit I mean? down yeah. and like. There, there's some songs, uh, and they're good songs, and people are like, learn this song, but I've never heard it before in my life. Yeah. And those are the ones that are like, you takes yeah, you time. you got to be into it. takes it. time to yeah. learn. Yeah. And anything now that takes time, because I play so much. Right. So on a Monday, like m- my days off, usually mm-hmm. I just do laundry and I don't really. Yeah, chill maybe, out. Maybe I long. like, if an idea comes, I'll start writing a song, but I usually. Don't play any music. Yeah. So Mondays would be my only day to actually learn songs or like during the day before shows. Uh-huh. And it's kind of like. I'd rather to, not do yeah. that in the one time moment but I have I, off. I have been learning some new covers, well, but they're I've been cheating because they're kind of, I already know them. Yeah. <laughs> I just haven't played them in a long time. So, well, you know, you know, you know. That's still dope. Still yeah. dope that you're, you know, you can teach an old dog new tricks sometimes. Yeah. The, uh, but man, thank you so much for coming yeah. out. Um, where can everybody find uh, Rocky Canega music, all, all that stuff? Instagram, Facebook, Spotify, right on iTunes or whatever, all that good stuff. The dudes TikTok on TikTok. You're gonna not, find. I, I was on TikTok for a bit, and then is it bad I, that I almost spelled it? T i k. T O K. When you that's how you that. spell it. That's how I spelled it. Is that how you spell it? Yeah. Oh, so I spelled it wrong. <laughs> okay. The T I C K T O C K. I mean, I, uh, yeah, I, I spelled it the, that way. I guess is that technically the right way to spell it? I guess I don't know. No, I thought it was a T I C K T O C K. Right. Yeah. That's the. We're not getting yeah. corrupted, guys. That I is the correct was, way I to spell TikTok. About it again, I was like, I oh think, my god, is that is how it you spell it? TikTok the app like spelled. T I K T O K. Yeah. I spelled it that way because the guy told me, he was like, man, you'll get a lot of hits. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it's done. It's not generating. Uh, I don't uh, know. You know, you win some, you lose some. But I, like, I think I, well, I take that back because on Spotify, I believe it's Grandfather Clock or no, it's TikTok. 
parentheses grandfather clock. Yeah. Okay, all right. Because Best I, of both worlds. Because, okay. I, because I was afraid. I was like, what if what if it did blow up? If I mean, it wouldn't. Is this what I want? Would I be sued? Would I be <laughs> yeah. sued by TikTok? Like, or like, what did they? Do I, I don't really? know. Yeah, that's a good question. Like, and I well, was it's like, a good thing you didn't so leave I, it a chance. So I did the parentheses. The what? Yeah, 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 whatever, yeah, yeah. Just, just in case. Like, yeah, but I, it's not. I mean, I doubt it. I well, mean, you, it's maybe, got a lot you know, of plays. Who knows? The um. Well, if you want to catch, think it, I think it's Finland. They they, they love the it Finns there. love you. Yeah, <laughs> oh yeah, it. interesting. Yeah. The uh, if you want to catch Rocky playing live, you know he's going to be forty nine out of fifty four days. He's going <laughs> to there's like a real high percentage chance you can catch him somewhere. So go over to Rocky Canega, uh, Instagram, like you said, website. I'm sure he's got one, all that good stuff. But uh, check him out, listen to his music, listen to the Spark and Plug episode, and um, keep your eyes on the horizon for that album. It'll drop one day, <laughs> <laughs> slowly when I, but surely. It, yes, sir. It, yeah, whenever I feel like it, it'll yeah. it'll come out. I really like. It. At first, I had my doubts. <laughs> like, sitting on it for a long time. Like, yeah. the first yeah. song, like, just releasing the first song, it took me forever. Because I was like, God, is it good? Like, is it good? Yeah, like, you, like, was, you fall on that trap, man. God. Yeah. Yeah. Like, you might as well, like, he's if got, I, any advice, any advice to anybody that records, when you get it back, just listen to it and go, okay, yes, everything's good, mastering, whatever, mixing, and then just release it. Just send it. Yeah. You heard it here first. Thank you, <laughs> Mr. Kanega, for coming out, teaching the people your ways. Yeah. Uh, appreciate it, man. Yeah. And um, thank you for having me. This is um, episode whatever. Yeah, this episode whatever. We'll never remember the actual 41. episode. It's been something like that. Wouldn't it be amazing if it was 41? <laughs> that would be incredible. Yes. Um, and if you uh, haven't yet, you had need to go watch uh, Rocky's uh, Spark and Plug set because it was fantastic. Um, you need to go to the website. You need to check out the podcast, the other podcasts we got, if you haven't already. And, uh, you know, go ahead and do all the other uh, social media BS where you follow us and uh, subscribe and blah, 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 all that good stuff. All right, this is Dylan signing out. Thanks for listening.